Ho, ho, ho. What, he doesn't even walk out? Ah, oh, EA, come on. Yo, Rumors here, and welcome to a FIFA 23 player review for 85 rated winter wildcards, Jonathan Claus. Santa Claus himself, he stands 5 foot 10 inches tall, he has high high work rates, his preferred foot is his right, he's got a 3 star weak foot and only 3 star skill moves. So you actually get this card by completing 3 assists with a right back. So you can do that in one game, you can do it in squad battles, rivals, foot champs, whatever floats your boat, whatever is easier. So quite easy to get, so he can play right back or right wing back his club, Marseille, he's got the league 1 links and the French links, I've stuck an anchor on him initially, we'll see if he's fast enough with that. So it boosts his acceleration up to 94, sprints up to 92 shooting not the worst finishing 74 shot power 84 long shot 74 his passing i mean 99 vision 99 crossing 99 free kick accuracy 99 short passing 99 long passing and 99 curve amazing passing so we'll test that out in game dribbling 88 agility 74 balance Mm, we'll see how that impacts him. Reactions 83, ball control 83, dribbling 82, composure 81. Pretty average dribbling stats. Defending boosted with the anchor. Interceptions up to 81. Heading actually meh at 68. Defensive awareness not the greatest at 79. Standing tackle up at 92 though and sliding tackle at 87. His physical stats. Mm, jumping 76. Stamina great at 97. Strength 77. Aggression 78. Pretty average. He's got the early crosser trait. I'm going to be playing him in the right back position in the 4 2 3 1 arrow in this team. So let's see how he plays. I mean, good switch. Klaus comes across there, claws, whatever. Good defending. Good inception, Verde, but they get the ball back. Good inception. Claws. Claws did well tracking back there. Decent pace. Claws advancing well on the wing. Gets past. What can he do? Oh, nice assist there from Claws. Got decent pace, decent acceleration. Found the pass as well. So he should. Claus managed to read that well. Good pass back. Claus does well there. Good play on the wing. Nice ball in. Orientes robbed. Damn, that goalie looks big. Klaus, 99 free kick accuracy. Mm, on target, decent save from Pope. Mm, Klaus did, almost did well there. Thought he won the ball back, but he's struggling. He has got the ball now. Tricky opponent. Claus, ball through to Verde, is he onside? He is, can he pick out someone? Oh, blasted home by Leal. Good pace there, Claus. Nice. 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 Nice assist there from Claus, I believe. Oh, my clearances have been terrible. Putting myself in trouble. Good inception, Claus. Nice return pass, Claus. So after seven games with Claus, we didn't get any goals, but we got two assists, not bad from the right back position. And my opinion on the card, well, before I give that, if you could quickly please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already, that'd be greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. But yeah, my opinion, well, if you don't complete him by accident, go into a squad battles game on amateur or beginner or whatever it's called, assist three goals with a right back, 
and voila, you've got him. And if you don't like him, stick him into an SBC. There's a 385 rated card. This is as close to a free card, well, other than those gold cards that EA gave out today. But yeah, as close to a free card as you'll get. I mean, three assists from a right back, you can do that in two minutes and leave the controller there. Squad battles is done. That's if you don't complete him while you're playing normally. But yeah, he has enough pace. I think the anchor boosts it a bit up to 94 acceleration, 92 sprint speed. He feels fast enough. Obviously, he might get beat from time to time with the Alawirans in the game, the Mbappes, but good enough for a card like this. Dribbling, he feels competent on the ball. Shooting, I didn't get any too, too many shoot, shooting opportunities with him, but he has decent stats there. His passing, yeah, actually felt good. I think that is underrated passing in FIFA 23 because it's really important to get your passes as accurate as possible. And I think with Claus getting down the right-hand side around the left-back, when he gets to the touchline, that 99 passing is going to make a big difference as to whether you're going to pick out one of your guys for a tap-in or it's going to be intercepted. So I think the 99 passing is really good. And also the free kick accuracy, 99. Put him on your free kicks. I'm sure he'll score some. Defending and physical, average. Nothing amazing defensively. So that's probably what lets the card down. He is a right back after all. But yeah, I mean, as close to a free card as possible, go and do it. But that is only my opinion. Please like, subscribe and comment if you appreciate it. Take care.